Hello everyone and welcome back to my current household project Ingrid. So I am here and a lot has changed since the last time you guys were here. So Ingrid is doing really well. The house is the same just bigger um there's also been a little add-on to the very top so before it was very petite and small i will see if i can get it up on the gallery real quick um if i go on to my box you'll be able to see how it's changed yeah see it's a lot slimmer here and smaller and here it's a lot wider because I tried to expand it and the reason for doing that is because they had a kid so she met Winston Bowers or Bores or however you pronounce it I don't know um and he's rolling his eyes to the high heavens right now I have no idea why but this is a screenshot moment right now <laughs> that is absolutely hilarious that is hilarious um um but yeah this is the lady who delivered him we had this little kid and he is not happy right now he is in a bad bad mood um <laughs> and his name is owen i think he has mama's last name i think his name yeah owen elder they are married they got married in the civilian glade and they had they eloped and 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 got married and it was all very pink and blossomy and beautiful um the house on the inside has has changed so um we have the sitting area we've changed the color of the floor just to add a bit more color and life to the room the kitchen's pretty much the same but um we've got some more postcards i think we're nearly i'm doing a bit of collecting at the moment i'm having a lot of fun collecting all the collectibles and um at the moment we're doing pretty well with everything um let's just yeah so we've nearly oh no we're not really collecting the plants but she does some gardening we're we've ne we're nearly halfway well we kind of are halfway to getting all the frogs um the sims trophies we're doing well with those and we're doing the metals and the crystals and the elements and the postcards yes we've nearly got all of the postcards which i'm really happy about um yeah because i'm having i've never done that in my game so i'm really excited about doing that and we're also doing fossils we haven't started microscope prints yet but i might do that maybe space prints we're not really doing aliens and space rocks but i would like to get a rocket and go to space um we're doing a bit of fishing we're not doing insects or any of this stuff we can't really do decorative eggs because that's all ended so i don't know why that's still there but yeah so we have been doing a bit of collecting so we nearly have all of the postcards here's some of the selfies with winston this is a little dining area so much of it is the same but now we actually have like a family place to sit and eat and the window area is expanded um upstairs she has an aquarium for all her little fish she's got two gold fish in there uh, an exotic goldfish i think no we're not gonna yeah so we've got an exotic goldfish a bass a guppy and two goldfish and a minnow so yeah she's like collecting all her little fish in there we have this adorable little cc um plant thing a lot of you guys have been asking where have you got your cc this where have you got your cc that i am planning on doing a video just hold on because it's taking me a very long time um but i am planning on doing one i'm just very busy with uni and everything i got my first assignment back today um and i got a 2-1 which i was pretty happy about a first would have been nice i was five marks away from a first but i'm happy with a 2-1 um <laughs> so yeah he's a bit about a bit about winston you guys don't know nothing about him um he's a jealous sim he's clumsy he's domestic and he's family orientated he is an artsy sim so he's a watercolor dabbler at the moment he's in the artist career he even though painting is very much 
how Ingrid gets her money and it's a very prominent hobby it's like his life and his passion to do artistic things so you know he would of course love to open an art gallery and make money that way and that's something I definitely want to do in my little current household but for her it just brings in the money and it helps expand her home and now it helps support her family so you know they you know she met him and you know their relationship grew they got married they tried to get themselves financially stable for have a little child you know to make sure they were in a situation where they could bring up a kid and when they got to that stage she got pregnant and it was a little boy and that's when Owen came along and this lovely lady lived with him um Margaret Van Van Quee Van Quee um yeah and she came around to say hello um this is her little garden patch out here she still has this um this is the back of the house in case i didn't show you and this is the extension that i added on up here so if we go up in that room you can see so this is where she keeps all her collectibles and her favorite paintings these are two of the favorite masterpieces that she made um it's a masterpiece it's a realism painting and it looks like the galaxy and i just think it's absolutely beautiful and then we have this forest one i thought this was very awe to me and it's it, it's it matches like her personality in a way it sort of describes her background because remember she is an elf um and it's another large classic painting and it's a masterpiece and i think that was beautiful so i just have to keep it more often than not i will sell them but when i think it's just stunning i have to keep it here's her little frog collection that she's got going on it extends over here we've got some fossils and some need tidying up another frog down here and he couldn't fit on the shelf got some spare elements some more rocks and stuff um some my sims trophies up here um some of the elements on the rack her little violin which she hasn't used yet but she fished it out of the river so we thought we would keep it and some of her crystals and some more my sims trophies so we're gonna probably extend the shelves all the way around the room because there's so much stuff that we need to collect but this is just like her little collectibles room it's like her little place where she can store all her little bits and bobs that she likes to go around searching for we also have a pumpkin carving table because i wanted to like include it into my game because i feel like spooky stuff is something that i never use now halloween's gone and i sort of wanted to try and keep it in my game um for a bit of fun we we did have a pumpkin there but i don't know where it's gone it disappeared it's it it's vanished so for some reason he's going and putting his dinner in the bin outside but um in terms of actual gameplay you need to use a toilet we've been doing a lot of upgrading because we had a lot of upgrade parts so that's what i've been doing but ingrid is very much being sort of a stay-at-home mum at the moment um and taking care of the family what were you doing up there and um he's focusing on his career and everything so he's gonna gonna do a small abstract painting because he needs to do it before his next shift because he just um come back from family leave she's cleaning the sink and you need to do your homework i think nope he's already done it um he's also been doing a bit of drawing he's an artistic prodigy as you could probably tell his parents are very um creative and so is he um he likes to play on the computer we've been hanging up some of his drawings in his room because it's a bit empty so i've just been sort of displaying them sporadically around the room I think it might not go nice under the window though. Here's his little birth certificate, which I think is adorable. I love that element to the game. Get to work was just the best. So I'm going to see if I can upgrade. Oh no, you, of course you can't upgrade anything. See if I can upgrade the toilet and add it to self-cleaning so we never have to clean that. That would be one less thing that Ingrid has to do around here. I don't know why he's complaining about dirt. Where's the dirt in this room? where is the dirt in this room the dirt is nowhere right he's finished this so we're going to frame the canvas and sell it to collector i don't know whether selling to the collector or selling to the art gallery makes you more money so i'm gonna see right she obviously wants to pee but she can't because ingrid's fixing the toilet so souls um so what is that why is the lump of clay floating around my house? Okay. 
What is her handiness skill now, I wonder? It's nearly level 6, so she's doing quite well. She's very much the man of the house. Winston's quite a feminine man. He doesn't mind living in a big pink house with tons of pastel colours all over the place. Because he's very much like that himself. He's 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 more on the, on the feminine side. He likes to wear a bit of pink. He likes to paint. And, um... But he loves Ingrid and they love each other and they have a very, very good relationship. They spent a lot of time getting to know each other and everything before they went ahead and got married, which was cute. Um, he's going to go and view the fish. Uh, why don't you play with your toys? You have so many toys. Why don't you play with something? And there we go. Uh, does that build creativity? It does. That's cute. I didn't know that did that. Um, so yeah, the house is pretty tidy and everything. We Have we had dinner? I think they already had dinner. I think they had black bass and brownies for dessert. Um, she does need to... Does she? Or does she not? No, she doesn't really need to come and do the garden. There's nothing to collect yet. But we are going to go on a bit of an expedition maybe to try and find something. She's just having a little sit down after doing all that hard work. And I don't blame you. I do not blame you. Um, let's frame this. This time we're going to sell to the art gallery. No, it's about the same, so it doesn't even make a difference. It doesn't make a difference. Um, uh, I'm going to have him play some sims. She's talking to him. Let's have a bit of a conversation. Let's express our admiration towards him. Teach him a valuable lesson. Ask about school, how's school going? Share insecurities about him doing well at school. Like, I want you to work really hard. I don't want you to be a bum. I want you to be successful. Brag about handiness. How'd you like the new toilet? Do an impression. Tell him a funny story. And express love. <laughs> that is super cute. I didn't think I. Well, yeah, she does want to have a really big family. This is. <laughs> oh my god, I caught her mid hug. <laughs> but yeah, she does want to have a really big family. So he definitely won't be the first kid, and this, and we're definitely gonna have to have like a much, much bigger house. Um, I'm gonna go and brew some coffee. Um, I think it's time for bed. So no, we're not gonna brew any coffee. We're just gonna head straight to sleep, get everyone in bed, cause it's late. It's a Wednesday, very, very early morning, and everyone needs to go to bed. So we're gonna turn all the lights off and wait for them to wake up so yeah when building an art gallery is probably one of the things i would do next maybe when we've got to about ten thousand simoleons that's what i'll do um because we're not we're not struggling to pay the bills or anything but i like to have a couple of thousand just in case the bills are unexpectedly high go and get some breakfast he's gonna go and grab a brownie for breakfast so is he and she's still sleeping because she's probably tired from all the hard work that she was doing yesterday brownies for breakfast let's talk about dreams have an inside joke boast about family <laughs> they're so cute like father like son right ingrid's just woke up we're gonna go and brew some coffee in the morning keep ourselves energized for the day well coffee literally is like the worst thing for you but i don't it's not the worst thing for you but in terms of keeping you awake it's not good in that it's not going to keep you awake all day you'll have to keep drinking it it's sort of a bit like carbs where it will give you a sudden surge of, surge of energy and then it will just slow back down again it's just like energy drinks are terrible for you but i don't i don't I don't really need anything like that. I've never understood why people feel the need to drink coffee in the morning. I don't. I just, but even if I'm like tired, I'll just get on with the day. I don't like tea either. 
I'm not, I, I just, I, I don't know. I don't like tea, I don't like coffee. I don't, I don't have a clue what, I guess I wasn't brought up on it, so. Um, we're gonna get him to study. You're supposed to be at work, so can you go to work, please? His work uniform is so weird. I don't know why he has to wear that. Before it was a yellow t-shirt as well, and it was horrible. Right, I'm gonna clean with the vigor, seeing as she's feeling so energized. I'm gonna get him to work hard. She needs to pee first, though. We'll probably do some painting to get us some more money towards our art gallery because she can submit some work in there as well. You know, it could be both there. A vision for both of them. Um, make a special recipe. Let's make a party size high protein plate. That sounds healthy. Lots of meat. Keep you full for longer. See, that was very quick. Nice. A nice bit of meat. And that'll be something for the guys to come home for dinner later. So we're going to grab a serving. Got some eggs on there. I think that's asparagus. And we got some meat. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in the fridge. And they can have that for dinner when they come home. Ingrid's having it for breakfast to get her through her day as energised as possible. And then we're going to come up and do some painting. We didn't finish this. But she never really has time to paint when she's running around the house doing all the chores and stuff. So, when she gets a chance and she has the house to herself, that's what she likes to do. Margaret would like to come and hang out. Yes, you can. They seem to be quite good friends. I don't know. Maybe they had a connection when she was delivering the baby. Who knows? But also... Her ex keeps calling Antoine, the one we fell out with. I don't know if I did that on camera or not, but we like fell out with him and like she doesn't even speak to him anymore. But he keeps calling her and asking her to come around and we've just been ignoring his calls because we have a new life now. That is so pretty. Oh my god, that would go so nicely in the bedroom. Oh, never mind. Goodness. I wanna keep it. I wanna keep it. That is so pretty. I can't I can't. I'm sorry, you're going to have to do another one. We'll do a large classic because that's always brings in the big bucks. Um, but yeah, so did she not come over? She must not have. Cause she, oh no, there, she's sad. Oh, why is she sad? We can try and cheer her up. You might have to come up here though because we're kind of doing something, so... Okay, just stand there then. Just doing this painting again. I think I might have done all the classic paintings. Oh, yay! Someone's grades are up. He is now a B at grade student. Well, you can continue that by doing your homework. And when Dad gets home, if you're still doing your homework, you can carry on with that. So let's try and brighten her day and cheer her up a bit. Let's tell her some jokes to make her laugh. No, we're not going to ask her to leave. She was feeling sad, so he doing his homework he is and when he's done that he can grab some dinner and you can clean that up for your mother it's gonna take her forever because she's talking at the same time she literally does two strokes and then she starts talking again oh we completed another part of our mason baron so the next goal is to have a home worth 100,000 smolians and to purchase 5,000 pounds worth of landscaping. Right. Okay. Let's frame the canvas and sell to collector. 914. That's not the best. Um, but that's all we could get done for today. Um, let's get the food out. Lay it on the table. Not on the floor, on the table. And, um, oh, a dragonfly. And get the brownies out and lay them out for dessert. Actually, no, I might leave them in there because people go and grab the brownies before they've even eaten their food. Right, let's come down and call it a meal. Everyone, come and grab some dinner. It's dinner time. Thank 
sit around the table and eat your food. Such a cute family picture. The roses in the way though. She's like, eat your greens. I'm watching you. Eat them greens. <laughs> Where is he going? Why are you moving seats? That was the perfect angle. I don't know why the other lady hasn't come to grab some food. <laughs> I wonder if this will actually keep them fuller for longer because it does in real life. I wonder if it actually will. That would be interesting. Yeah, because she's she ate this morning and she hasn't ate since and she's already full. But who knows? That might just be because she's just eaten. <laughs> it always makes me laugh when they do that. Bean? <laughs> I don't know why it does, but it makes me laugh. I find it so funny. Oh, she went. That's why she didn't grab any food. She's trying to avoid having dinner. Can you clean up your plate, please? Thank you. So Ingrid can go and get out dessert for everyone. And we'll put that on there. And we'll call to meal for dessert. Dessert is ready. I baked the brownies. Everyone come and grab brownies, please. Brownies. Oh, that's all the brownies gone. I don't know where you're taking that brownie. Sit down and eat that brownie. Um, play The Sims for 24 hours. Has it really been that long? To be honest, I nearly played this all day yesterday. I could not stop playing it yesterday. I was addicted. I could not stop playing. I was like, I'll stop playing at two. I'll stop playing at three. I'll stop playing at four. And when it got to four, I was just like, you know what? I'm just going to keep playing until I get sick of it. And I literally played until like eight o'clock. I'm not even kidding. It was ridiculous. I couldn't stop. I was having so much fun. It was so nice to feel like I, every time normally I play The Sims when I know I have a deadline or something, I feel so guilty for playing because I know I should be doing my coursework, but now I don't have any coursework because I've done it all until December. It was like, oh my God, I can play The Sims and not feel guilty. It was so good. Right, can you come and clean up after dinner, please? She just got a sunflower frog. Thank you. She found a ruby pretty. What are you doing? Come and do some fishing. Have you done your homework? Do extra credit, please. And um, I'll get Dad to come and help me with that. Uh, and it would be cute if they became best friends, because that's adorable. But it's gone now, so. She caught a chichalid. I think that's how you say it. Chich, chich lid. Chillid. Killid. Sillid. I don't know. I think it's chillid though. And she caught a trout. Right. Well, well done. Let's go to the toilet before you pee. Um, go and have a shower because you smell. And you can go to bed. Because it is way past your bedtime, like it is most nights. Oh, he fell asleep in the bath. Bless. She needs to pee. Go and pee. I don't know if he'll mind her walking in because they're married. Sometimes they mind, sometimes they don't. I never understand that he doesn't mind. He's still asleep. He's completely oblivious to the fact that we are on the loo while he is in the bath. If it's a number two, he will surely know about it. Let's wake him up. Come and sleep in bed. He didn't get much of a shower, but never mind. Go to sleep. He got more sleep than he did a shower. He has work in two days, so that gives us plenty of time to get some more paintings done. We're so close to that 10,000. We can spend about five grand on a... Oh, we also have mail. Five grand on a new little art gallery. I don't know what I'm going to call it, so if I have any suggestions that would be awesome so we got one of our new elements 
um it's really really cool i'm gonna go and put her fish in her little aquarium i'm also gonna get her to do some painting but she smells so i'm gonna let her have a bubble bath you need to get up and pee please yeah they don't mind which is good what do you have to do before school go and get something to eat and stop staring at the fish he needs to take a steamy shower because he's grungy and you need to brush your teeth and maybe serve up something nice for you and Ingrid to eat for breakfast but before we will clean out the nasty food we'll have some fruit and yogurt parfait we'll have something super snazzy and he's gone and broken the sink because that's what, how Ingrid wanted to spend her morning cleaning up your mess we'll have some fruit and yogurt parfait and we'll empty this and make some coffee and we will sit so let's repair this before we go downstairs he's probably secretly making up for breaking the sink by making her breakfast in his pink shirt he normally only wears the same thing over and over again let's clean that counter please no, you're not supposed to be eating yet. No, Ingrid, no. No, 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 no. Clean this, please. And you brew some coffee. Now. And then we'll call to meal and we'll have some of this. I'll grab some coffee. Can you eat, please? What are you two doing? You're supposed to be sat at the table. But if you just want to stand around and make this the most unromantic thing in history, then fine. Will you come and sit? I have no idea. I'm just going to ignore that. Please come and sit. Thank you. What is this? Why is there fruit and yogurt parfait up here? sit please this is how i imagined the morning this is how i imagined the morning <laughs> thank you very much finally right she's probably way too full to eat that and it's probably gonna make her feel sick so let's just stop finish your coffee you're probably gonna need to pee though so go and pee we'll get him to clean up our mess <laughs> And get him to study hard. Um, we'll scavenge for parts in there. And once he's finished doing that, we can come and do some painting. So I'm going to get him to do a paint from reference. I'm going to get her to throw this away. Oh, what is he going to paint? Paint of the fishies. There we go. Right, we're not going to go on the computer. But we are going to do a large realism painting. Do some freelancing to try and get this art gallery opening underway. We also need to spend loads of time filling the room with artwork, so that'll be that'll be something, you know, finding some really nice pieces to fill the gallery with. Personally, things they've painted or sculpted would be nice, so I might get him a little woodworking bench and a bunch of other things that they can do creative things with. So that came out really bad. Um, that is really bad quality i think you need to critically assess your own work because look at the state of that why is it so fuzzy and blurry but a collector might want it i guess why are you in so much pain can you do your work please do a landscape painting Right, have you finished? Hurry up. You're both not having any fun. I don't know why they don't get fun from painting. 
Right, Owen is done with school for today. A, B is not a bad grade, but that doesn't mean there isn't any room for improvement. Yes, what's wrong with a freaking B? B is good. All right, do your homework. It's not fun, but you need to do it. Seems like everyone in this house needs to have a bit of fun. Um, I'm gonna have to have like a cheeky TV sesh, a movie night or something. After repairing the television, of course. I actually finished this. I'm gonna sell to an art gallery and frame canvas. Sell to collector. So we're nearly at ten thousand. We're very close. Now I don't come and sit and wait. For that. Actually, no. Go to the toilet first. I don't want any interruptions during movie nights. Stop calling us. We don't want to come out with you. I'm sorry. Right, let's watch comedy. We'll watch a rom-com or something. But you have to finish your homework first because you're not watching anything until you're done with your homework. And we'll come and we'll watch the current channel. Ah, so cute. These two are so cute. It's adorable. Right, I think you should do some cleaning up. Clean up for your parents. They've been cleaning up all day. Look at this. Been cleaning up all day. Probably should have done this while their son wasn't home, but it's too late for No! Throw it away. And clean up this. And then you can do some extra credit. <laughs> You're not having any fun, but as long as you get the extra credit done. Why are they watching the TV still? Stop watching the TV. Stop watching the TV. Go. Okay. <laughs> I hate you when that happens. Right, is he doing his homework? I hope so. I don't want him walking up here while this is going on. Right. So guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part of my current household. I hope you enjoyed the little update into what's going on and I will see you next time. Bye guys.